60th championship of the Canadian Pacing Derby in Toronto. They're off and pacing. Four Star Shark, Armbro Proposal, fastest away. Cam Ocean along the inside. Electric Stena spots into the top four. Cam Cracker crossing into the top five, but can't find a hole as Real Desire comes through along the inside. And LCB is left in seventh. That's confirmed winner eighth on the outside. Life Source is ninth. And by a length, by a length back there in tenth. Over to the first turn, it's Four Star Shark. He's going to go under attack. Cam Ocean is pulling on him. Cam Ocean up and moving early. 25 and 4 was the opening quarter. Cam Ocean. Paul McDonnell make the lead. Four Star Shark is going to get a pocket trip. Armbro proposal on the inside third. Electric Stena is fourth. After three eighths of the mile, that's Cam Cracker in there from fifth. Real Desire pulled to the outside. Six by Campbell right now. LCB is seventh. That's confirmed winner eighth on the outside. And the struggling final pair are Life Source and by a length. Cam Ocean up at the half. It's on the board in 54 and 1, 28 and 2, second quarter. Cam Ocean going on the lead into the final turn of the 60th Canadian Pacing Derby Championship. Electric Sten is first over. Four Star Shark is in the pocket. Real Desire spotted second over right where he needs to be to be close up to the leaders. And on the inside, fifth on the final turn is Umbro Proposal, sixth outside, new confirmed winner at head stretch. Then along the inside, that's Cam Cracker with Life Source LCB and dropping out of contention was by a length they turn for home electric stena applying a whole lot of pressure to cam ocean electric stena steve condren have taken the lead from cam ocean now real desire is seeing clear track 123 the three-quarter time electric stena real desire campbell had him second over he's the champion of the 60th canadian pacing derby real desire in a league of his own is the pacing derby champion by a length over four star shark electric stena third cam ocean fourth real Real Desire in Campbell, 149 and 4. He's a very easy horse to drive. It makes my job very easy. You speak of that determination. How important is that when it comes to a horse race with this kind of competition on the go? Well, that's what separates uh, the great ones from the ones that, uh, you know, have ability and just don't realize their potential. Um, I mean, he's he's raced at a top level from uh, 2, 3, and 4, and, and this day and age and the speeds they go, that's just amazing. He looked terrific coming for home. Uh, at which point did you say to yourself, gosh, uh, he's going to do it again? Well, around last turn, I felt pretty confident. I hadn't used him, and he was, uh, you know, second over and, and well within striking distance. With this victory goes over $3.2 million life's earnings. Real Desire, champion of the 60th Canadian Pacing Derby Championship in 149 and 4. In the winner's circle to make the presentation, we're pleased to have Mr. Jake Howard, the honorary chairman of the board of the Woodbine Entertainment Group. Thank you.